For Mashable, I'm Adam Falk. Are you using your iPad at night? This might not come as a surprise, but a fresh study by Mariana Figuerno at the Lighting Research Center shows that two hours of exposure to backlit displays, that's just about every gadget these days, can suppress melatonin production and delay sleep patterns. 13 test subjects read, watched video, and played games on backlit tablets, and their melatonin levels got knocked down by as much as 22%. That's the hormone your body cranks out that tells you it's time to sleep. Production ramps up at night or when you're in dark conditions. Exposure to bright lights like those found in smartphones or tablets can disrupt your melatonin levels. Depending on how long or how frequently those levels are out of whack, imbalance can lead to everything from restless sleep to an increased risk of diabetes and cancer. Participants were placed in one of three groups, one control, one wearing goggles with built-in LEDs that are known to suppress melatonin, and a third wearing goggles that filtered out the short wavelength light from the tablets. Each wore a device called a dimensimeter, which measures both light exposure and activity levels to collect data about sleep rhythms. Figuero hopes manufacturers will eventually start building devices that respond to day and night rhythms automatically. If you don't want to give up your iPad in the meantime, Figuero recommends dimming its display as much as you can at night. For Mashable, I'm Adam Falk.